Hi guys, in today's video we're going to see how much GP I can make in 24 hours. So right now, um, my timestamp here is at 2.20 a.m. And we're going to go until 2.20 a.m. the next day. So it is um, Saturday, May 9th, 2.20 a.m. We're going to go till Sunday, May 10th at 2.20 a.m. And we're going to see how much money I can make. Um, in this video, I'm going to be using everything and my skills in my bank. In my next video, um, I'm going to create an Iron Man account, and we're going to see how much money I can make on an Iron Man in 24 hours. But here we go. The time starts now, and there's no more screwing around. So the first thing we're going to start doing is running air orbs. I already have a tab set up for air orbs. I'm just going to go through money making methods this um this video and show you how much you can make in 24 hours by doing multiple things um so i just planted a farming patch all four farming patches i just collected all my coconuts and everything and i just sold everything so the first thing that we're going to do in this video guys is take all my coins out and exchange them for platinum tokens so you can see all my coins at the end we're going to ship, shift drop these 35 GPs in the fire over there. <laughs> and we're going to take our platinum tokens and store them there. So now everything that we make will be in gold um, in the next 24 hours. So what we're going to go ahead and do. Actually, I want to go pick up my gold. I'm going to go pick up my 35 gold and we're going to start a bank tab with it. My bank tab is worth 35 gold, wouldn't you say? So, 35 gold is our new bank tab and this is what we're going to build off of in 24 hours. What we're going to go ahead and start doing is running air orbs. You need 81 cosmic runes and um, so you set your X to 81. Then you need uh, 27 unpowered orbs in the magic level of 66 so um, three cosmics per air orb and go ahead and teleport to Edgeville and what you need to do if you haven't been here before is just run south into the dungeon now this may be a two-part video depending on how long I have these clips but we're gonna go ahead and give it a shot here I'll show you guys how to get to here and the first money making method we're gonna show you is air orbs so here's my inventory and we're at 13.8k so we're gonna put all 27 charged air runes into my price checker when we're done here now a lot of people have a Bring a doling here and they teleport to clan wars which I have to start doing if you enter the free-for-all portal you can recharge all your stats here recharge your uh, run and your prayer or whatever so I mean that's up to you if you want to do that I hear it's a better method but honestly I just pot up at the Edgeville bank sometimes if I need to usually I'll AFK while I walk to the uh, air orbs or the air ob obelisk these demons will hit you pretty hard you can always use protect from Molly uh, here and they won't hit you as bad so when you get up here I always go to this side so <clears throat> you can see PKers easier you want to go to your magic spell book charge air orb use it on the obelisk and hit the space bar or you can also Curse, use your cursor to uh, to start that spell and it'll auto all of uh, these 27 air orbs and then uh, I'll go ahead and show you the clip of the price checker here alright so here we go 27 you guys saw it before it was uh, 13k now we made 33k so there's our first profit on the air orbs we're going to go ahead and take that and drag it into our tab. We made 36k so far. And there's one method we're going to do. 
and then I'm gonna head over to farming and show you the rest of that all right so we're gonna go ahead and teleport to the ranging guild which right below south of it is a farm patch for allotments herbs and flowers and got 70 farming here so right now we are doing the highest herb we can snake grass and oh I forgot to buy more snake grass and limb port so what I'm gonna have to do is use my air orb money to buy more snake grass seed because um I kinda used it all or I uh spent all my snake grass money and then I put it into or I I'm sorry I sold all of the snake grass and I put it into platinum tokens so uh, now since we're starting fresh we gotta use all of our May GP from this 24 hours to spend money to make money but I guess I can leave the snake grass out and I would make more money if I left the snake grass out which I probably will do. I'll collect the rest of the snake grass and we'll make more money off of Limport and um, these herbs if I don't plant snake grass. So we're going to finish this seed off here and plant this last patch. Pay the farmer for it. So we're just going to plant limb ports and uh, the herbs. I'm not going to bore you guys with my farming. I'll let you know when this patch is done. Alright, I just used my necklace of passage to check on one of my trees. I teleported to the outpost. So I'm going to my fruit tree now. And I'm going to pick my coconuts off of it and get profit that way because they're expensive. Now I'm not going to cheat guys. I'm not going to sell anything from my bank for money or anything. I'm only selling what we make in 24 hours and all the items. So that being said... I'm going to get some coconuts here and if you want to plant trees here you need the required farming level to do it. I don't know it off the top of hand but palm trees and it's north of the agility course here. There's also one in Karamja and there's one um, if you teleport Castle Wars and go south let me just show you you go northeast from Castle Wars. Here is one. Um, right by the maze there is one in Catherby here. And then there's the one in Karanja. And then I'm at the outpost one or the so I've already hit most of the tree patches, so we're just going to go ahead and head back to the Grand Exchange. So in just 15 minutes, we've already made 71k. Um, just going around farming and just doing one air orb run. So we're going to go ahead and continue with these two money making methods for quite some time, uh, hours on hours, and. Um, we're just going to go by the 24 hour time frame from 2.20 a.m. to 2.20 a.m. the next day. I, that's including sleep, the little bit that I may get, <laughs> and um, that's including everything that we have um, built together up in one day. So I'm not going to, and that's including breaks and everything. I'm only going by that time frame. This ain't total gameplay. In 24 hours, I'm going by the time frame of 2:20 a.m. to 2:20 a.m. the next day. So I ain't cheating or anything. We're keeping this tab, 
And I'm just going to keep running these air rooms and farming limports and coconuts and herbs. Uh, we're done with the snake grass. Once all that is collected, I'm not planting anymore. Um, we're not buying anymore. I'm only using the supplies that I have in my bank built up. And we can buy more stuff to make more money. We can do some alking. Um, but it's definitely going to be a two-part video. And, um, yeah, we're just going to see what we can do in 24 hours, I guess. Stay tuned, guys. Please subscribe. Um, the next video will have all the action.